Welcome to the What's New video for SOLIDWORKS 2019 Weldments. This is Eric Vega. 2019 Weldments now feature a new tool which helps organize and reduce the sketches necessary to create a weldment structure. In this year's rollout video, the Coengineer team decided the best place to hide the secret spaceship would be inside a barn in plain sight. In this video, we'll cover the different features inside this tool, called Structure Systems. Previously, Weldments required every single member to be defined by a sketch segment. Now, in 2019, we have multiple methods to create members on the fly with only reference entities. To enable the Structure Systems environment, we'll go to the Weldments tab and select Structure Systems. Once selected, you'll see that the upper right will show where within the environment. In the Primary Structural Member Property Manager, if you click on the Profile tab, you'll see the traditional interface used in Wellmans to select the cross-section that we'll utilize for every member. In this case, I'll select square tube and 4x4. Under the Member tab, we'll have four types of primary members. Path Segment, Reference Plane, Point Length Member, and Face Plane Intersection. Path Segments allows the traditional selection of sketch segments but it also allows the selections of edges for surface and solid bodies. Here I'm going to use the selection box to select every edge on these surfaces. The reference plane member uses intersecting planes to define the length and position of new members. For illustrating purposes, I will use this upper plane and the top plane to define the length, and this incline plane to demonstrate the resulting member when we select intersecting planes for the second set. We won't use this member here, so we'll jump to the next option. The point leg member allows selection of sketch points, as well as lined endpoints to extrude members by a defined distance normal to the sketch plane. You can also use the selection box here to expedite your workflow. I'll set these weldments to 16 feet of length. Face plane intersection creates members from intersecting surfaces or faces with planes. Now we'll use the secondary members. Here we have support plane and between point members. Support plane will automatically create multiple members on selected planes between existing primary members according to your successive selection. I'll create the horizontal weldments in two groups to avoid creating overlapping members when we add corner management later on. Now I'll create the second group of secondary members. This time, I will only select two horizontal planes, the top plane and plane one. This is to avoid overlapping geometry with the barn roof. This feature can really save significant amount of time with a little planning. I will add a few more segments to the barn roof and move forward. The last secondary member type is between points. It adds connecting members between existing weldments by a defined distance or length ratio from the endpoint of the selection. I'll use length ratio and reverse the direction of the reference for the roof supports. Finally, when I finish all members and accept the structure system, it will take me to the last step, corner treatment. Here, all joints will be grouped as either simple, two-member, or complex joints. The active group is highlighted in yellow in the display. The user interface is somewhat familiar to the traditional weldments by allowing you to select to miter, planar, or do a body trim according to the arrangement of the joint ends in the property manager. 
Complex joints are defined as three intersecting members or more. You are giving a lot more control for the trim order, trim tool, and planar selections to achieve the desired result. When you finish setting up all corner management, you will notice all of the work can be found inside two simple features. This allows for easier control by using the display to select the corner that you want to modify when you edit the feature corner management. This has been Eric Vega with Go Engineer Tech Support. Thanks for watching.